So I'm Andreas Peichel, I'm Professor of Public Economics at the University of Mannheim in Germany and I'm also head of a research group called International Distribution and Redistribution at the Center for European Economic Research also in Mannheim, Germany. My research interests or research areas are at the intersection of public, labor and welfare economics with a special focus on the effect of taxes and government policies in general on income distributions and labor markets. So I'm a lead author in the chapter on inequality or the paradoxes of inequality. And uh, in the field of inequality research, I'm especially working on the effect of tax policy on, on inequality. I'm interested especially at the top of the income distribution. So looking at the top 1%, their income wealth and how they are affected by, by policies and how they accumulate wealth over time because those are the people that have the money and when we want to tax and redistribute incomes, we need to target those people. And I'm also interested in uh, equality or inequality of opportunities. So to see whether people have equal chances to, to make it to the top of the income. I hope that we get some attention in the media and in the public and to, to steer a debate and to, to, to make people think about uh, what is the current status of the world and to see whether we can get people actually interested in this topic, but also to, to make an impact on, on policymakers to, to change things because I think there are a lot of important issues and we need to, uh, policies and policymakers to change a lot of things in the world to, uh, to make it a better place. So um, there, there are two issues, I think. One is an in the, what, that we observe an increasing inequality, increasing concentration of income and wealth in the hand of very few, at least in, in, uh, in, in many countries. And uh, I think that that's a big problem because if uh, there's a lot of concentration of wealth and income, this also means a concentration of power. And uh, giving this increasing power or political power maybe in the hands of a few, that I think that's not a good thing for society, for democracy. So we need to, to we should be worried about this and we, we need to think of what we can do about this. And tax policy is, is one, one, one instrument to, to, to change this. And the other thing is the, the question of, of opportunity. So ideally, one w w should wish that every baby born has the same chances, the same opportunities to, to, to become whatever he or she wants. So to, to become president, to become rich, or to become uh, just whatever they want. But we know that people don't have the same opportunities within one country or between countries around the world. And I think um, that's where, where, where we need to think about how, how can we uh, achieve equal opportunities. My, my work re, uh, related to, to social progress is um, it's an, uh, kind of indirectly related to social progress. So I'm, I'm trying in my work trying to measure the impact that government policies have on, on, on inequality and also on the behavior of individuals, also on, on, on opportunities. And so uh, finding out what, what, which policies work better than others, I think it's important in helping to design better, better systems, better, better institutions to, to achieve better social progress in the future. I think that's, that's where I can come in and contribute it by, by telling people maybe it's better to use uh, to tax income than wealth or the other way around or it, uh, to, that they should actually tax people and redistribute it to, to poorer people that this could actually be good for, for society. And I think that's where I can come in and help and try to do my bit to, to contribute to this. Oh, there, there, there are so many problems I, I think we should, they need to be solved. But uh, I mean, the, the, I think the, 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 there are several dimensions. So of course, we, it, there, there are a lot of people uh, living in, in poor conditions and in, in, in poverty. And this leads to a lot of other issues like um, migration, uh, my big migration flows, which, which are a problem for, for uh, many countries. So those who are uh, losing good people that try to m uh, move to the north and they, there's a problem of what to do with the, the migrants or refugees. Of course, related to this, we have a lot of areas of conflict and war. And I mean, there are, it would be nice if, if we would, first of all, live, live peacefully together uh, by the end of my lifetime. But uh, I don't think that's ever going to work because that's against, I think, human nature. But um, if, if we don't solve all these issues, I think at least what we should try to uh, solve is the, the problems of extreme poverty and to, to provide everybody uh, in the world some opportunities to, to live a decent life.